Hello, friends. This is Dave Hurwitz, executive editor at ClassicsToday.com, here with How to Build a Record Library in 1953, courtesy of Howard Taubman, music critic of the New York Times, and his incredibly fraying book, How to Build a Record Library. And we're working on keyboard music, the B list. Now, the B list is all the stuff that they considered to be a little bit more unusual or non essential. And I think there's some very curious things here. So let's get right to it, shall we? We begin with Albanese's Iberia. Boy, Iberia is an A-list piece if ever there was one, don't you think? But I can understand that it's not part of the standard German canon of Bach, Beethoven, Brahms, and in the world of piano, like Chopin, right? But I, and Schumann, those people, but gee whiz, I mean, you know, okay, never mind. Bach, chorale preludes for organ with Helmut Volk. Oh, the Iberia was Claudio Rao on Columbia. Yes. Now, the, the Bach was the chorale preludes for organ with Helmut Volk on Decca. I mean, that's it for Bach organ music? I mean, not the trio sonatas? I mean, not any of the toccatas and fugues? I mean, not, well, I don't get that. Bizet, Jeu d'Enfant for piano forehands with Vronsky and Babin. They liked Vronsky and Babin, obviously. Brahms, I mean, is anything by Bizet even in the second tier? That's an odd one. It's not that it's not good music, of course. It's just, you know, in terms of your priorities. And then they have Brahms chorale preludes for organ with White on Mercury. Brahms chorale preludes for organ? I mean, I know they exist. I, I mean, who listens to them? I mean, now you're all going to say that you listen to them. I know. Go ahead. Have fun. Okay, Chabrier, three romantic waltzes for for two pianos with R and G, Robert and Gabi Casadesu on Columbia. Again, Chabrier? Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. See, all the French people are on the B list. It shows you what their prejudice is, doesn't it? I mean, their prejudice is for, their prejudice is for the German school of keyboard writing, plain and simple. And anything that's not German is on the B list. I'm so not with them on this. I can't even begin to tell you. So here, finally, we get the Debussy image and preludes with Walter Gieser King. But, you know, this is not B-list material. No way. I mean, there are things on the A-list here. I would get rid of some Schumann, first of all. You don't have to have everything by Schumann. I could get rid of some, uh, some Liszt. I could get rid of some Mozart forehand music. Great though it may be. You know. All right, never mind. Uh, so we have, then we have Foray. See, I told you, it's French. It's on the B list. Uh, these six bark rolls and six nocturnes with Boine on Vox. And Granados, Goyescas with Felenzi on Remington. The Spanish repertoire goes with the uh, French repertoire as B list stuff. I mean, Goyescas is nobody's B list. I mean, be serious. Grieg, lyric pieces. Johansson on Vox. Handel, harpsichord suites, four separate discs. Performed by Peleg on on Concert Hall. That's a lot of Handel harpsichord music, considering, even if it did B-list stuff. Prokofiev, Sonata Number no. 3, Suggestion Diabolique with Weissenberg on Columbia. Sonata Number no. 3, Vision Fugitive with Leonard Panario on Capitol. And the Summer Day Suite with Liv on Concert Hall. The Summer Day Suite by Prokofiev? Is that even B-list? Especially since it's not coupled with anything else. That's an odd one, don't you think? Ravel, complete piano music, Casa de Sue, three discs. It's French, it's on the B list. And last but not least, there is some more Schubert. Forehand piano pieces with Bedora Skoda and Demas on Westminster. The Grand Duo with Bedora Skoda and Demas on Westminster. The Sonata in A, Opus 120, and the Moment Musico with Gold Sand on Concert Hall. And the Wanderer Fantasy with Clifford Curzon on Decca, which is a great Wanderer Fantasy. And that's the B list for keyboards. Boy, is there a lot missing there, don't you think? It's kind of remarkable. Absolutely. I mean, there's no, well, of course, there's no like CPE Bach, God forbid. There's no Haydn, God forbid. There's no Shostakovich. I mean, there's no, oh, I mean, the list could be tremendously long, couldn't it? Uh, of course, Shostakovich had 1953. I don't even think it had been written yet. <laughs> Spray Lids and Fugues. Maybe that's why that's not there. But gee, 
I can think of quite a few more things besides um, that really deserve to be on the A or B lists aside from that. So a quixotic and strange couple of lists, I think, as we've gone through these two. Uh, let me know what you think about the B list. Is it really a B list? Is it sort of an A list that's disguised as a B list? You tell me. Keep on listening, friends. Thanks for joining me. Take care.